All right, hello everyone. Today we're gonna to be talking about how to use Foxy apps. And it's basically a AI tool that you can use to develop these useful apps to put onto your website. And then it generates kind of these lead magnets for you so you can acquire different leads for your businesses. So first off here, we have us logging into the Foxy apps app. So there are a lot of different use cases, but today we're gonna to use the gym owners use case. When you click on that, it'll open a new form that is all about gyms. We're gonna scroll down and as you can see, there's a few different lead magnets, but today we're gonna to focus on recipe finders. So click check out the app, great. And then once you have this app, um, right now you can use a mock version. So for example, let's type in an ingredient. Let's say banana is our ingredient for today. And we want to do breakfast, so that's fine. And then maybe we are, you know, gluten or let's just say dairy adverse. So let's put eggs, no eggs in here. And then specify diet, let's go keto or vegan. Generate. All right, while well, that generates, as you can see here, it's got a great recipe for vegan banana pancakes without any eggs in it. Um, it will give you the ingredients and the instructions. So this is awesome. Um, now we want to actually set this up. So we're gonna click up set up lead magnet. And it'll take us to this page where you can customize things like the window um, app mockup, you can add phone number or email. Right now we're on the default theme and you can even change your button background. So like that, you can change it. Um, there are different um, add-ons that you can upgrade for, but today we're just gonna stick with the basic one. So after that, we're gonna click generate or create lead magnet. Awesome, now we have a HTML code that we can copy. So we're gonna copy that. So after you have a copy, we're gonna open up the browser screen for um, you know, our website. We're gonna use this tester one for today. And um, for Squarespace, it's easy because all you have to do is add in a block. We're gonna paste in the new code, wait for it to load, and boom, now you have a recipe finder. So we're going to hit save on that. And while that's saving, we want to go back to the Foxy apps um, screen and hit check again and the lead magnet. So now that you see it's green, the lead magnet is active. So when someone puts in their email or their information, it should come back to Foxy app. So let's go back to the um, website and we are actually going to exit out of here and expand our screen right here and try this out. So let's try again the same example of banana, breakfast, eggs, vegan, and this time we are going to actually put in our email. Hit generate. And as you can see, it's going to generate the same um, instructions and ingredients for a awesome vegan banana oatmeal pancakes recipe. After that, you're gonna go back to your um, Foxy app screen and click on your profile. From there you can click lead magnets and now you can see show leads has one new lead. From there you can click on it and see exactly the email, the phone number, the app name, and when it was created at. From there you can export this list as a CSV and use it for other targeted lists or for your own records. So that's basically how you would use one of the pre-made AI lead magnets on Foxy apps. All right, so another cool functionality is that you can actually build your own app. So on the top right, you click build app. And in this case, you could create different type of forms and we're just gonna do one about an article writer. So we're gonna type something like this where the input type is text and the label we're gonna put is what topic do you want to write? Oh, sorry, what, what topic do you want to write an article about? And then the variable name will be something like example, watch brand. Click save. And then we have the variable watch brand. So the prompt would be to prompt, I guess, ChatGPT or some other AI, it'd be write an article about your variable, whatever that variable is. And then you can, um, the output type would be text. And then you could also do a run and test, right? So in this case, we'll type I don't know, let's say Rolex, right? And then we'll put run and test. Okay, now you see that it actually worked, your little app about you know what to write an article about. So there's an article here about Rolex. 
So you need to do next step. And then now you can name your app. So you could call this um, article writer or whatever your app is, is called, article writer. Um, and then we'll just do, keep these all blank, generate, I think this is fine. Um, let's see if this goes, submit for review, nope. So let's say this app writes articles for topics. Topics, all right, submit for review. And now it's creating our app. And now we can check my app and there it is. Um, so the same thing, we'll set up a lead magnet like we did before. Oh, reach. Okay, sorry about that. We have the free version, so we have to delete one of the apps. But now you can set up your lead. <laughs> Fail. Okay, so we got it under control now. But basically, you create your lead magnet again. And again, you can make these adjustments if you'd like here, add email address, phone number, or whatever. And then you create the lead magnet. And then again, there's your code. So you copy your code. And then we're gonna go to our website again and do an edit and change the code here, save it. And there's our new lead magnet. So we're going to exit and then we click check again on Foxy apps to see that it's running and yes, it is running. So we'll do a little test here again. What do you wanna write an article about? Let's say watches. We'll put our test email address and a test phone number six, seven, and we'll generate. And there you go, it's putting the, the little article there about watches. And again, if you go back to your profile, click on uh, lead magnets, you can see the leads are right there. And again, you can export it as a CSV. All right, so that is a wrap on the Foxy Apps Lead Magnet Generator. Um, this is how you build a lead magnet um, that's pre-existing or build a brand new app. So in our next video, we're actually going to be doing a review of Foxy apps to see, you know, what we like about it, what we don't like about it and more. So stay tuned and thanks for tuning in until next time. See you later.